Hello everyone and welcome back to Mixbuzz TV Mixing and Mastering Tutorials on YouTube. I'm your host David and today we finally get to compare the most famous best sounding budget compressors out there. We got many requests for this and here we are with the FMR Audio RNC, really nice compressor, and the RNLA, the really nice leveling amplifier. Allow me a few words on these two compressors before we start with the comparison. Most of you know the RNC is the transparent one and the RNLA is the colored one. Years ago, everyone was talking about them, specifically the RNC which came out first. Now, one thing I'm sure you heard about the RNC is that it's very, very transparent. And that's true, it has no color on its own, has none of what we call color box, just passing audio through it, which is, trust me, a good thing in most cases. Color is cool, but it doesn't always work on everything. Transparent works on everything. Might not be flattering, but it works. With that said, I feel something people forget about the RNC is how nasty and ridiculously snappy this thing can be on drums. And because it's transparent, it still sounds open and airy. It can really add an incredible punch to either snare, kick, or full drum. What really surprised the audio world when the RNC came out years ago, um, I think has been misunderstood a little bit. Mostly because, yes, I'm going to say it, people didn't know how to use it. Specifically, I'm talking about the super nice mode. I'll admit, more than 15 years ago, I didn't get it either the first time. Because if you try to use it in the same way you would normally use compression, it doesn't sound right. The trick with the super nice mode is to keep the material compressed the whole time. That's when this little thing will surprise you. If you keep the material inside its knee all the time, compressed all the time, you will hear how this compressor is capable of crazy amount of dynamic control in a completely artifact-free way. Yes, the RNC will fart a little bit if fed bass heavy material long bassy notes but uh, it does have an external side chain for that if needed and there is where the rnla comes in now rnla the rnla is still one of my favorite colors and i mean in the big picture when you think api color neve color chandler or retro it's great on bass vocals but the point is i really like its color and behavior even compared to much higher price units. But without further ado, let's get to the file. Bass, drums, and vocals. And I'll see you at the end of the video for some final comments. Here we go.
why I am Why could I give just to be a man so proud The saints will collide on my way to the sky Can I ride in the wrong direction? Should I be leaving the soul salvation? What should I do just to sanctify my life? Can I ride in the wrong direction? Should I be leaving the soul salvation? What should I do just to sanctify my life? Waiting for a long time. What could I give just to be a man so proud? The saints will call out. What should I do just to sanctify my life? Can I ride in the wrong direction? Should I be leaving the soul salvation? What should I do just to sanctify my life? Hating all around. What should I do just to hear my heart so loud? Scraping right on down When my so-called friends keep the snake eyes on the crowd Saints we collide on my way to the sky Can I ride in the wrong direction? Should I be leaving the soul? Salvation, what should I do just to sanctify my life? Can I ride in the wrong direction? Should I be leaving the soul salvation? What should I do just to sanctify my life? Hating all around. What should I do just to hear my heart so loud? Scraping right on down When my so-called friends keep the snake eyes on the crowd Saints we collide on my way to the sky Can I ride in the wrong direction? Should I be leaving the soul salvation? Why should I do just to sanctify my life? Can I ride in the wrong direction? Should I be leaving the soul salvation? Why should I do just to sanctify my life? So they are pretty cool, aren't they? I really said everything I wanted to say about these compressors in the introduction, so I won't drag this any longer. Just a couple of things if you want to go back and listen to the files again. It's really incredible the amount of compression the RNC can do in super nice mode without any artifacts. Listen to that again. And not only on vocals, but even more on drums. Makes it really dense and it doesn't choke it. On different settings, it gets really, really snappy, giving the drums that punchy attack, but as you notice, it never gets speedy or harsh. The RNLA, on the other hand, has this really nice glue to it. Again, very good on drums, very good on vocals, love it. The color is never plain distortion. Um, it's subtle, but really noticeable. Usually both make the final cut on my mixes on some elements or another. They are cheap, they're great, I've always loved them, and since many of you were half surprised that I use these along with the high-end stuff, I wanted to show you why. That's a wrap. This is it for this video. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. If you like this video, please don't forget to click the like button. Follow us on Twitter and Facebook. We have exclusive content in there, pictures, and most important, you can stay up to date with the upcoming videos and series. If you enjoy our content and our videos are helping you in any way, please keep supporting Mixbus TV by sharing the videos on forums, blogs, social media. Subscribe if you haven't already, and see you next time.